Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Kingdom Hearts 3 Let's Play. I gotta stop saying that in the wrong order. To use the death margin. Last time, Xemnas and Ansem showed up at the same time, and that was mildly confusing. Xemnas, I don't fully remember what I did to him in Kingdom Hearts 2. I'm pretty sure he got super murdered. But I definitely know that and some Seeker of Darkness got super murdered, so I'm not sure what's up with that. Let me picture that guy. That was adorable. And I take one of you. They're actually pretty docile. Look. I got my camera up. I wonder if I can use that to my advantage. Oh no, they'll still hit me. Unless that attack was initiated beforehand. But well, we got some pictures, that's all I need. And there's definitely a big flashing no camera symbol, so I think maybe they, they thought about the camera cheese. But I bet some talented speedrunners can probably figure out some cool tech with that. If not, that's maybe something they should look into. Oh, wow, they hit me from there? That's a questionable hitbox. You are big and glowing. I'm not sure why. Why are you glowing? Oh, because you got hit with the thing. Also, I learned from the lizard. I didn't take a picture of a fat body. Oh my gosh. This is going to be a running thing. Like, this is gonna trigger my OCD. There's no way. Yeah. What's up, dude? Stupid monkey. Oh yeah, and the nice thing about Blizzard here is that you can actually grind on these rails. I learned that in 0 0.2. So you actually want to use Blizzard at long range compared to like close range, I guess, for fire? I still wish fire was the, the circle thing, but what are you gonna do, right? That's back to where we came, right? Okay, let's fusion spin. Team up with Goofy. Way better teaming up with Donald. And customize. Get rid of the ether and put in Blizzard. Because we can't. I bet you there's a lucky emblem here. Are you saying that because there's another one here that I don't have, or because I saw because the other one that I saw? I don't know. Whatever. It's probably fine. We'll worry about getting all of them after I finish the game. I will get the ones that I find as we go. Sick flow motion. I think incorporating the, the flow motion into this stuff is fun. I just don't think flow motion by itself is a very neat or well implemented idea. It is neat, it's just I don't think it's well implemented. It's the same problem I have with it as I do with Dream Drop Distance. It's canned attacks that don't flow super well together. Like you can't combo with them like easily at all, really. Because you have to stop a combo, so it'll be like one, two, three, and then dash, and then do stuff. So then there's that, and that doesn't combo super well. It's weird. I like the idea, but well, not the implementation. Well, my bagpipes! It was you laddies who rescued my chef! I can't do strongs! Huh? Wait, didn't he sell ice cream in Hollow Bastion? That's right. But Uncle Scrooge here is what you might call a world traveler. Cool. A little more literally than you might call other people. How are you, Uncle Scrooge? Oh, hello, Sora. You're looking hale and hearty. I heard you were on another grand adventure with these two. I hope Donald isn't making a menace of himself. Uh, why did you have to say that? So, Uncle Scrooge. What's that you were saying about a shelf? Oh, right, right. 
The chef of me bistro here wanted to show you his appreciation. So, he baked this for you. Hmm. What is it? Wow! Cake! Hmm? The whole cake? It's for us? Huh? I uh, settle down. Uh, the chef wants you to know it's not a cake, but a tart of fruit. He does? Why keep it under my hat? May I introduce Little Chef? Oh, oh it's you! Uncle Scrooge, you open the bistro and try on time! Hi! It all started a little while ago, when I was enjoying one of the best meals of my life. And when I asked to speak to the chef, I met this wee genius. As it turns out, he wanted to expand his culinary horizons. So I thought, that's an opportunity. And I financed the whole operation. Ooh, I think he wants to cook some more for you. Fetch some ingredients, especially anything unusual. That'll be fun. Kinda like a scavenger hunt. And the more the better. The mark of a truly great chef is creating masterpieces out of anything. You can start right here in town. We'll do anything to try more of Little Chef's food. Yeah. That tart sure did look scrumptiously delicious. Okay, the ingredient hunt is on. Yeah, too bad the cake's now in my butt pocket and it's gone forever. A little chef's bistro, you can transform the ingredients you've gathered into delicious meals. Eating the cuisine you prepare will grant you beneficial effects like temporary stat increases. It's Final Fantasy 15. They really love to steal stuff from this game, huh? I just saw. Wait, no. Misha Shugio. <laughs> nice. Little chef needs more ingredients. We better keep an eye out. Ah, that's why these boxes are here. Well, I'm starting to get hungry. Gotcha. Wait, there's a treasure. How did I miss that? Hey, fluorite. We use that for uploading the keyboard, don't we? Well, we did up until we couldn't use any more fluorite. I guess we can upgrade the hero's crest. Let's see. Excuse me, sir. If I buy some ingredients, does that count? Oh, do I have... Wait, hold on. I must yeah. have money for the... Damn it, Huey! Damn it, Moogle. All the things I want to do. I want to upgrade my Keyblade. I want to get the dog. So one's lying. Okay, where on earth is Carmen San Diego? Where can I get some more ingredients? Do I have to go scratching the dumpster? Oh wait, hold on. One less item that needs to come from the garbage. This is a little uh no more a waste of your time for me. This is not promising to be overly long, but still. Yeah. Huh. Uh, over here, we can check. This is yeah. where we played the trash mini game, isn't it? There's probably good food. We can't leave. Little chef still needs our help. There's only so many places to look for ingredients, Sora. Okay. Fine. Yes, we're still short. Let's keep searching. Can't believe I'm stuck yeah. looking for food. Just imagine the yummy stuff little chef will whip yeah. up with this. Hey, check it out, guys. Wow, they actually I didn't realize they gave me money the first time. Did I hit this one already? I guess I did. We can't leave. Little Chef still needs our help. I get it, guys. We all love Little Chef. As much as I love 
the movie I haven't seen. Yes. I believe he could. I will hit everything. Parkour. D did I just uh, mom's dead parkour on that guy? It's a giant bomb reference for anyone who didn't pick that one. Up. Hey, guys! Oh. Painter, Olette. Uh, hey, boss. Uh, Down with the posters. Uh -huh. Hi. Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film festival in the courtyard. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, Sora. Hold your phone up to the poster. Okay. There, you've just downloaded a promo game for the film. You can try it later. You can on this, Uncle Scrooge? Of course, laddie. Provide a bit of entertainment, and then give folks a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry, and eager to spend their money. <laughs> it's just devious enough to work. Gore, she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over. Oh, yeah, I'm no business guy, but I sure wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I need to warn you guys. Why? Well, those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure. But don't we have you guys to take care of him for us? You have to leave again? Mm-hmm. But we'll definitely be back. When are you gonna slow down? Sorry. Just do me a favor. Well, what is it? Don't make it too tough. I know how Roxas feels to be lost. But Donald and Goofy, Kyrie, brought me back by wishing with all their hearts. So, I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. What? That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. I'm wishing. Yeah. Me and Pence, too. <laughs> Thanks. Aren't you making it a little too obvious? We were instructed to guide him. Yes. Just look at them. They wouldn't get far if we did not spell it out. Huh. Fair enough. But let's not forget how many times Sora still managed to rain on our parade. If he wavers from the path we lay, we destroy him. But in that case... We'll have to find ourselves another vessel. That is why we never have just one iron in the fire. Spooky. Also, I'm not sure that's how QR codes work. You still need access to the internet to download a game. So you select class kin kingdom from the gummy phone to, to do the thing and play a mini game. Hey, the pre-order DLC Keyblade. Emphasis on magic. Form changes double arrow guns, magic launcher. Shooting star Keyblade can be form changed to a projector weapon called the double arrow guns. Hold R2 to aim and automatically to fire. Okay, that's cool. Some ranged options. May as well equip it since we have the extra Keyblade slot. Magic treasure magnet. High jump, 
double flight, combo master, leaf bracer. That's cool. That's also cool. Meteor shower. Wait. Okay, that one. I'm not sure which one of these is which. Because this one has three. Uh, you know, I'm just going to assume that I got this. <laughs> and we're going to move on. Uh, okay, cool. Cuisine, let's cook some stuff. Cuisine you cook with Little Chef grants you temporary stat bonuses. Baiting a full course. I'm gaining an extra ability. I assume the extra ability is not permanent. Wait, why give me the option if I can't... If I don't have any ingredients? Didn't I collect a bunch of ingredients? What is this? What a lie. What a lie, dude. Alright, uh, you know what? Let's give it a shot. Oh man, these are old games, huh? Avoid the giant's attacks and escape the room. Use a spoon to spring onto the table. And press X to open the curtain. Move to the pepper shaker. And press X to make it sneeze. And candle holder and press X to jump from, to, from thing to thing. Oh no. Oh, you can see my inputs. first. Get me there! Did it! Oh, awkward. Not falling for that again. I really don't know what to make of this. Darn it. They're slightly desynced. That's okay, because I got it now. How many levels are there here? Because this is uh, getting to be a little more than I bargained for. It. Uh, can I stop? I'll probably get something for this, don't I? <laughs> Did I ever finish my sentence from before when I was talking about a thing I saw the other day? I saw a trailer for a different mini game. You know what? We're... Oh, that resets it. How do I leave? Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. We got all this stuff. Saves my actual photos, which is that's cool. Adversaries. What do I have a picture of? Pop it? A picture of a pop cat. Does it show me the picture of the thing? No? Alright, well, you know what? You know what? I don't care. I don't care. All I want is my dog. Hello, Huey. Why don't you look around? Dog. Thank you. Chef Puff, or Chief Puff, and a statue of Hercules. Oh, that's cool, it shows me where to get specific ones like that. Hmm. Okay, so I can power that up. 
Or I can just power this up. This sounds more my speed. Shooting star. Cool. Alright, well, um, moving on, I guess. Right? Do I have anywhere else to be? I don't think so. I have an objective is explore the world. Hmm, that's not very specific. We brought some ingredients. Maybe this is what they want me to do. Let us go hang out with Ratatouille. Do they call him Ratatouille, or do they just call him Little Shelf? Little Chef. Shelf. Is the food ready yet? No. Huh? Hmm. He hasn't started. Huh? Whoa! Whoa! Hold on! Hey! Hey! Oh no! Oh! Whoa! You're gonna learn, you... Sora. Uh, you're gonna make me cook? Look how he stares at the camera when that happened. Okay. That's uh, I guess a good entree going. I love entrees. Crack the egg as skillfully as you can. Left and right sticks outwards to apply pressure. I want R1 to drop into the thing. What game is this? Thanks, Ratatouille. I'm good on this one. How about we go ahead and... What is this? A new soup? I love soup. Soup is... Maybe one of my favorite types of foods. Actually, I think it is my favorite type of food. Rapidly tilt left stick to chop. And right stick to pull up the next one. Yeah. Alright, we're in there. I'm chopping like a right. motherfucker. We did it. I don't know how that makes a soup, but good job me. Uh any fish and uh, you know, fish, whatever. Okay, I think I got it. The on the on screen graphics are pretty helpful. What? I pressed it. Oh no! Sorry. That's a damn lie. You know, those were just shakers. Like, I could just pick it up and keep going. Did it. Alright! We did it! I'm the greatest, dude. Nice three stars. Not a five star, but it'll do. Some good old meat. Meat's also good. I, I prefer tender meat, honestly. Uh, left stick in a circle to pour until right to flambe. Flambe. Got it. Got it, All one. Right. I'm a natural born we cook, dude. It. That's not really how restaurants work. Ah, my bistro's future is looking bright. The new recipes are a smash. Those ingredients of yours must really have got little chef's gears a turning. Soon we'll be chasing customers away. Keep up the good work. <laughs> we try, right, little chef? <laughs> well, on the plus side, Sora is learning a lot about how to survive by himself now that he doesn't have a mom. One more yeah. since we're here, right? Nice. Did it. I'm actually terrible. Right. Like, straight up garbage at cracking eggs and putting into a pot in real life. 
I don't know what is wrong with me. I just like hulk out and just destroy eggs. Like I try to like tap it on the uh, bowl thing. I tried tapping it on some more solid surfaces. Tried crushing it in my hands, like the the skulls of my enemies. Nothing works. I always get like either the whole egg just shatters in my hand from my vice-like grip, or I get and I get eggshells in there, or it takes me forever to crack it open because I'm too ginger. There's no medium, man. Okay, now that I've done that, can I? Yes. Let's do the thing. Brazaza. Join our Brazaza reaction commands without meeting the requirements. Cool. We're gonna. Yeah. Yeah. Do I get an indication of that buff anywhere? Oh, it looks like right in the bottom right corner under my health bar. Where the health and the focus gauge meet. Explore the world is still my objective. I bet we'll find some ingredients I'm not around. Not sure here. what to make of that objective. Does that mean it wants me to stay in Twilight Town, or does it want me to wait, or want me to leave? It's letting me leave, so I guess I'm just gonna leave. I, I'm like, I don't know. Does it want me to go back to Pence's place? I'm sorry I left without saying goodbye. Did Master Yensid tell you? I'm training to become a Keyblade wielder like you. That's right. No more waiting for you to come back from your adventures. I want to get out there and do my part to help. Merlin has used his magic to bring us to a place where time doesn't matter. We can take as long as we need to complete our training. He's an amazing wizard. Oh, and by us, I mean me and Lee. He's really sorry for all the trouble he caused. I told him it's fine, but he won't stop apologizing. I'll admit I was a little scared of him at first, but I've gotten to know him better. All he ever wanted was to help his friend. Honestly, it's hard not to like him. Every now and then, I catch him staring at me. When I ask what's wrong, he says, I'm not sure. I think I'm forgetting something. Don't know what. Sora, I think it may have something to do with you. Your journey is all about helping people. Some that you've never met before, and some like Lee that you have. They're all counting on you. It won't be easy, but I hope you'll remain the happy and cheerful Sora I know. There's no heart your smile can't reach. <gasps> What's wrong? Huh? Uh, nothing. Sorry. Lee. What? I am. <laughs> A letter? Yep. To Sora? Mm, technically, yes. But I won't send it. It's more for me. Ask Merlin. He'll deliver it for you. Yeah. But it's okay. I just like talking to Sora, even if it's on paper. Oh, okay. Oh. Hmm? Here. Where the fuck? Ice cream? Really? Yeah, I asked Merlin to pick these up. You know, we did both summon Keyblades. Gotta celebrate. You're sweet, Lee. <laughs> nah. What? 
Well, uh, nothing. I just... You're trying to remember what you forgot? Well, I, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So tomorrow, you and me in the ring. You ready? Of course. Don't hold back, Lee. Promise? Oh. Oh. I was gonna say, I thought this was about Xion. Are you okay? Lee? Uh, yeah. Sorry. You're crying. What's wrong? Uh, something in my eyes. Lee. I'm gonna go. Sorry. Okay, but stop apologizing. Fine. On one condition. What? Call me Axel from now on. Got it? Memorized? Yeah. Okay. That's Axel. so dorky, but I actually love it. It's weird though, I remember watching one of the trailers and that uh, line from Kyrie is saying like, you and me in the ring, are you ready? That happened in the trailer after they got their new outfits. So that trailer is definitely messing with people. As far as timing of scenes and also like what even is in the scene. What a weird way to promote a game. The super anti-spoiler. So this is the place where Aqua fell into the realm of darkness after she dove in to save Terra. Yeah, she said he was acting strange. Strange how exactly? She sensed darkness in him, and they ended up getting into a big fight. Right, and in the aftermath, the two of them disappeared. Around the same time, the guards found a stranger with white hair lying unconscious here in the square. A man calling himself Xehanort. Ansem the Wise took the stranger in, but that was a mistake. Xehanort betrayed his master, stole his research, and along with his fellow apprentices, separated his heart from his body. Xehanort's heart took his master's name, Ansem, and traveled to the past to give his younger self instructions. He even briefly had control of you. His empty body stayed in the present, took the name Xemnas, and founded Organization 13. Their goal was to prepare 13 vessels for Xehanort's heart. Until we put an end to the organization. But all the while, young Xehanort had been visiting the future to choose 13 vessels of his own. Hearts with strong enough ties to him to begin a new organization. The real Organization 13. And now they're looking for a fight with us. But what happened to Terra? I thought you said that Aqua saved him. Yep, she did. The problem is we didn't notice. You remember the end of the Mark of Mastery exam when Master Xehanort made his grand return? That's the Xehanort I remember. He was already a pretty old man then. But how do you explain Ansem and Xemnas, his heartless, and his nobody? Isn't it strange how young they look? Why aren't they old men? It's because Xehanort was using a different body when the split happened. That face from the portrait I mentioned? It wasn't just some stranger that Ansem the Wise took under his wing. It was the young man whose body Master Xehanort possessed. No way. That was Terra? Master Xehanort was using Terra? Yup. Master Xehanort told us another on our list belonged to him. 
He was talking about Terra. Turns out, Aqua saved more than just her friend that day. Okay. But Master Xehanort is an old man again now. Where did Terra's body go? Hmm. <gasps> it's because Master Xehanort's collecting vessels. He claimed to have two of our seven lights. We got Sora back, but Terra must still be on Xehanort's side. He's with Organization 13? We should warn Sora. Yup! And Merlin, too! Yeah. Okay. Nice, yeah, Bistro, got it. It's an interesting cutscene. Why are they calling into question Xehanort's old madness now? Hmm, interesting. Well, I'm not gonna edit my gummy ship. Wait. No, I just want to edit... I just want to edit this. I just want to add stuff to it. Can I do that? Just gonna put that giant doggo here. Is that okay? How do I get doggo? something from my dog. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Put, put Doggo back. You guys do. Doggo stays. How do I remove? We're gonna take off these wings here, I guess. Get rid of that. See, we're already in there, but just for symmetry's sake. Put that away. That's gonna look weird. Uh, did I accidentally delete my cockpit? Yeah, put that back. Oh. There's a problem. Just gonna shove it back a little bit. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna go well. have a doggo. Oh no. Perfect. Change skin. This is an extremely elaborate thing. Folks do not exceed the cost line. I guess they do, technically. The liars do. Okay, fine. I'm getting this doggo. There we go. Who needs anything? Uh, doggo. Ship. Got it. Yeah, that's rad. Alright, well, um, yeah, in that case, next time on Let's Play Kingdom Hearts 3, I see we have a choice of a couple worlds to go to. Let me see there. There's Twilight Town, I see Olympus, I see, oh, that's Jensen's Tower on the right. We're going to go to whatever is on the left there. Kinda looks like Toy Story? I'm not sure. I know Toy Story is in the game. Kind of looks like that, I guess. Anywho, thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see y'all next time. Bye!